Welcome back. As we earlier said that uh, His Excellency the Head of State President Abdel Fattah Sisi uh, witnessed a major breaking through uh, event that is going to mark history starting from yesterday uh, in the history of Egypt, uh, inaugurating the uh, first phase of new Mansoura city as part of a total of number of 14 cities that uh, sequence of cities that is going to take its course in the planning for inaugurating the new republic. And of course, uh, together with a new Mansoura city is the new uh, Mansoura University and a number of other universities also uh, in the Kahleya Governorate. And he also inspected Al Hassa village in Sherbin, one of the villages of Decent Life Initiative in the Kahleya. And uh, the presidential spokesman, uh, Bassem Radi, said, the new, said that the new Mansoura city is one of the smart cities that the state is uh, setting up nationwide. And this city is one of the development arteries in the northern coast of Egypt, of course, as we all know, because of its strategic important, importance. It also includes all facilities and services, such as the government areas, the hospitals, the markets, the places of worship, uh, the schools, and of course, universities, like I earlier said, uh, cultural entertainment areas, restaurants, and you name it, and also central parks. To shed more light on this massive event that took place yesterday, uh, we're very delighted to be having with us here live in the studio our dear guest, uh, uh, of course, uh, uh, good, good, good morning, mor good morning uh, <laughs> doctor. <laughs> Uh, so, uh, uh, how do you, have you, of course you've been watching uh, the, the massive event yesterday. So, uh, uh, of, of course, uh, Mr. Mustafa Abdurrahman, uh, you we, we were overwhelmed like every Egyptian citizen uh, watching this major uh, or leap step by uh, the president to fulfill, fulfill his dreams according to his directives. Because what we are witnessing now, is the dreams of President Abdel Fattah Sisi, the new republic inaugurating the smart cities. He started with Port Said first, then it's uh, um, uh, Mansoura city, then there is a sequence of other uh, 14 other uh, cities around uh, Egypt. So uh, he was really speaking with passion, as we in uh, the media uh, reported uh, uh, saying. He was speaking, he was very happy. He was giving a speech with passion and he was very excited also to witness the fruits of his efforts together with uh, uh, the rest of all Egyptians. Uh, tell me, uh, Mr. Mustafa, what is your impression watching such an event uh, yesterday? Okay. Uh, I've witnessed uh, the speech of Mr. Uh, Abdel Fattah Sisi, uh, the president of mm. the New Republic. Okay. I felt his, his passion and I felt really that he's. Uh, dreams are coming true. His dream of uh, establishing the new republic, mm. a new republic, a new uh, country is being built. We're, si we're witnessing uh, new cities mm. as if the, the old uh, country is being duplicated with a new, a newer and a better uh, country. We're talking about cities in the middle of Delta. We're talking about cities in the middle of Upper, of upper Egypt. Mm. We're not talking about cities just for the, the Supremes. We're talking uh, about cities for the people. For the low income brackets. Exactly. And the people of, uh, at informal settlements. I mean, this is a, a, a brand new step to be able to uh, upgrade their livelihoods and upgrade the, the types of life of those people. That's what's really smart about it. Mm. That's what's really smart about building uh, new cities spread it all over the, the Republic for the people, not, for, not just for uh, a small sector of the nation, but for, for the whole nation. And those cities are just Part, part of those cities are just like a kind of project that is uh, uh, giving the, 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 the money for new projects with the, the, the income of these projects. They build new cities, new uh, horizons, new hopes, new dreams coming true. Mm. As I told you, the most important thing, the most, the true smart thing about those cities are, is, is the, those cities are for the people, mm. for the nation, 
for the for uh, the the the, uh, the ordinary citizen. Mm. So that f uh, the, the the people he also delivered contracts to uh, the citizens for the housing units. He exactly uh, delivered the housing units for them by ha by hand. I know people, mm. my friends, uh, my uh, connections. Uh, they know they 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 go there and they buy and they have their chances to live there and to to change mm. this uh, their lives. Mm. We're talking about people having uh, the fruits of the projects, the, the, the national, the mega national uh, projects that some, some voices were, uh, were criticizing. Why are, are all those uh, mega projects for? This, this is what uh, those projects is for, for the people. We have established and we are building and establishing uh, a stronger base not just for the present, uh, the, the, pres uh, the present, we're talking about the future, we, we're talking about opening new careers, we, we're talking about uh, people who c can uh, find a new work uh, choices and uh, new ways of thinking, new, way new ways of finding uh, jobs for the youth. Mm. Uh, when you build a city, you make, uh, you, you open a gate, for too many uh, investments, for, two, for, for thousands of workers, for thousands of families to, to feel uh, hoop and hoop on the ground, based on the, well, based on the ground, walking on foot, ju not just uh, slogans and, uh, and dreams uh, and speeches or, or political speeches. Mm. Mr. President Abu Fattah Sisi has declared it quite well. He's mm. not a politician. It's not about it's not about p uh, politics. It's about building uh, the new republic with the hands of the the most uh, on the best uh, humans in Earth uh, in in Egypt. They are the the army uh, the army hands mm. along with uh, the the state hands and. So associates. Seven other companies or five. All, other the, companies. all those companies oh. are just. Hundred percent Egyptian. Ex exactly. Mm. We are uh, building the, the the smart cities. Uh, after we have uh, adopted this this new vision, not exporting uh, expertise, but nationalize it mm. and make our own way of building our own uh, identity, our own, our own uh, thumbprint mm. on, our, on each and every building we build. We, we, ha we have built too many cities and in each and every city you find the, 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 the Egyptian, the Egyptian spirit, mm. not a Western spirit. Mm. Not, uh, not uh, other... Uh, a national uh, spirit. Exactly. But also, he, uh, he, he had several important uh, phrases uh, during his speech yesterday. He talked about building or establishing such smart cities is not a luxury. It is because of the overpopulation that is increasing uh, every day in, in the state. So we cannot be concentrated in only Delta. We have to spread uh, to, to other parts because Egypt is... Uh, I mean, there are uh, very, uh, um, in, I mean, uh, suitable places that are qualified for citizens to live in, in Egypt. And it's important uh, for the city and for the government and for the whole country and the state to establish new cities in order to um, be able to spread all those citizens all around Egypt and also to create job opportunities. That's what I'm talking about. That's not what, what I'm trying to explain the meaning of uh, sp uh, smart mm. uh, cities. Mm. Smart cities mean that I open uh, opportunities for people to work, for other people to, to, to inhabit, mm. for other people uh, to find uh, a better w uh, way to live on a, on a very Egyptian vision, not just uh, printing our own uh, buildings and cities mm. with Western uh, uh, visions. No, we are talk take talking about the, the, the Egyptian identity. Mm. Each and every leader in the history of Egypt 
yes. has accomplished this step mm. to build and rebuild a mm. new city, a new uh, republic, a new mm. uh, country. Mm. Each, each and every great leader in the, in the history of this uh, uh, nation yes. has accomplished the same but, but now we are with the leader who not only built one city, he's building 14 cities and uh, a new administrative capital and a total new republic. I'm going to stop uh, uh, permanently here. Uh, I mean temporary here the, uh, now um, we're going to go to uh, uh, another playing you something that feature what we're sp uh, uh, talking about President Abdel Fattah Sisi as we all know we are talking about him inaugurating the new Mansoura city and also the uh, new Mansoura University and inspected the, the village of Al Hassa in the Sherbin Center and one of the villages of Decent Life Initiative and of course uh, it's going to feature the inauguration ceremony President Sisi also said that a comprehensive vision of its working path and the new smart city are inevitable for any nation's development. More details in the following report. President Abdel Fattah Sisi inaugurated the new Mansoura city in the new Mansoura University and inspected the village of Al Hassa in Sherbin Center, one of the villages of Decent Life Initiative. Spokesperson of the presidency said the new Mansoura city, which mediates the governorates of the Qalaya, Kafr Sheikh and Damieta, comes within the framework of a group of new smart cities that the government has embarked on constructing throughout the nation. Governmental areas, markets, places of worship, cultural and recreational areas, special areas for restaurants, and central gardens with a coastal view of Mediterranean Sea for a length of 15 kilometers. During the inauguration ceremony, the president said the state has a comprehensive vision of its working path and the new smart cities are inevitable for the nation's development. The head of state elaborated the new Mansoura desalination plant as part of an integral plan to save beaches and is considered the first in a series of similar plans. The president added the aim of building new cities, providing new job opportunities for citizens. Moreover, elimination of unplanned construction is a mutual responsibility of state and citizen. President Sisi delivered contracts as uh, social housing units to a number of citizens and honored a number of role models in various domains. Mr. Amr, uh, uh, how the president uh, at the end of the report was excited uh, talking uh, to the uh, citizens around him and also to the people in charge inside the, the uh, university, the hospital inside the university. I mean, inside, I guess it's a medica, uh, me medicine uh, department or something like medical department. So um, he was, uh, personally, he was excited and he was also happy to fulfill uh, one leap of his dreams, uh, inaugurating uh, the smart Mansoura city, well, one of the uh, the second city to be inaugurated. The first one was Port Said, and there was a long way. We came a long way in Port Said. We affected a long. We've been digitalizing and, 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 and the Mieta, of course. Yes. Uh, there is a sequence of other cities, but this one we we could uh, um, clearly notice that the president is, was really happy. Look, I have uh, relatives in Mansoura. Mm. And I've been there. I've seen the people reaction. I've, I've seen the people excited about uh, the new cities they are witnessing mm. among the country. You know, the, the country people are easily uh, affected by uh, good or not good. They feel it. They feel the, 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 uh, how large scale mm. the, the cities, the new houses uh, that are built in, uh, in their very historical and old and ancient mm. uh, governorate. We're talking about new governorate. We're talking about new uh, hopes for the people, for the ordinary ordinary people there. That's how the fe the, the feeling is uh, warm to uh, to and uh, to indulge this 
uh, new hopes and new streams of hopes that uh, Mr. President is pouring around, uh, not just in Mansoura, but of course uh, we're talking about 40, 40, 40 cities, we're talking about and other uh, projects that is really touching, getting in touch with people's lives, making it uh, better. The new Alamein city. Not just for those, uh, yeah, is yes, that new uh, Alamein. One and a half about, million for them. We have a long list. Mm. We are talking about uh, uh, a man who is feeling that his sons will have a better life. And he clearly stated that this is for the fourth generation. Exactly. The, uh, we are building a legacy for the fourth generation. Uh, talking about the fourth generation, we have been fighting against what they call it the fourth generation of war. And we are fighting back mm. by building a fourth generation, a fourth generation yes. cities. Right, right. That is true. Very true. We're talking about uh, fighting what they... Uh, they brought to us by, uh, by eliminating uh, that evil and cultivating new true hopes for the people. Hopes for people that really feel uh, honest about the efforts uh, accomplished. Yeah. They feel what the, 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 in the country, in the in the depth of country, you mm -hmm. can feel uh, people are the truly the people. exactly mm. away from the social media, away from the the, the influence of uh, Western media. Mm. We're talking about the people who are just uh, see what they believe and believe what the, what they see, mm. and they see on real ground. Exa exactly. Exactly. Uh, uh, Mr. Amr Abdul Rahman, uh, the political analyst, would like to thank you so much uh, for coming over to the practice show, and uh, you have a beautiful day. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me. Uh...